here has to find the female. Let's find out who you've chosen. Frank! <laughs> no problem. Oh, surprise, surprise. <laughs> Monica, Doug, and Jennifer all oh. voted for you. Okay. Doug, you can just go ahead and say bye now if you want. <laughs> Right. It's all right. It's all right. Let's see what hey, you got. It ain't dog, pet dog. It's dog eat dog. That's right. That's right. Let's see what you got. Guys, I'm from Las Vegas. There are, like, there are like more drag queens per capita in Vegas than anywhere. All right, friend, please come up here with me on my desk. Are you ready to meet the ladies? Absolutely. All right. Lady number one, will you please come and introduce yourself? <laughs> Hi, my name is Jersey, and I have more legs than a bucket of chicken. <laughs> Just lovely. All right, model number two, how about you? Oh my goodness! Hi, I'm Buffy. Bam, bam, choo choo train, boy or girl, it's on the stage! <laughs> Lady number three. Hi, I'm Roseanne. My friends call me Uncle Sam. Or is it Samantha? Oh, okay. Model number four. Hello, my name is Sade, and I I wanna be your brown sugar, baby. Oh, oh, oh. Lovely. Yeah. Lovely lady number five, please come forward. Hi, my name is Delta, and the two things that men love about me are one and two. Number six, please come forward. Attitude! Ladies first. Huh. I am the real diva. <laughs> <laughs> Decisions, Frank? I'm just really sad that only one of them's a woman, actually. <laughs> Let's go in order. Tell me what you're thinking. Okay. Number, number one. Wasn't very graceful walking down the thing, especially for a butterfly, so I think that might count against it. <laughs> oh, you can refer to them as lovely ladies. Okay, you, they are all lovely, by the way, all of you. So basically, though, you've eliminated number one. Yes, I have. Based on the graceful walk. All right, what about the cheerleader? The cartwheel gave a little more away than I was really expecting to get out of this game. <laughs> so, no. I really don't think so. All right, we'll leave it at that. So you've eliminated one and two? Yeah, yeah. Okay. How about the woman dressed in the flag dress? Ah. You know, I'm not sure about that. One's gonna have to sit on hold for a second, but... Uh, All right. Holding the lady in the flag dress. The next, the uh, one like looks like a really hairy pumpkin. Yeah. <laughs> uh, oh my god! I'll I... keep him here. You lady, please stay there, lady. Yeah, could you? <laughs> You're gonna need some protection later. I have a feeling. Yeah, no. How about that voice, though? The voice you rock. Wonderful voice. Well done. Beautiful. I'm very impressed. No, it's lovely. I just don't. I don't. I don't think so. You're not buying it. No. Now look at this next outfit. I don't know. She is a hottie boombalai. Yeah, she's like the Betty Page. She ate her. <laughs> I like the way your mind works. Maybe I'm gonna step away from you too, Frank. I need a shield, Brooke. Come on. <laughs> I'm telling you, I am so afraid of I what think I'm you're feeling. I'm afraid of number five. That's I admitted what's that going right here. from the beginning. Okay, you know what? But so, I don't so think so. So what did we decide? You don't think? I don't think so. You don't think that she's the real no. woman? No. Okay. And the uh, Victorian 
George Washington thing going on over here. He's got some too, man. She does. She's I love it. You, and I don't know guy. a man that can have that kind of attitude. And she, she sounded like she was trying to make her voice a little deeper than it was. So it's between those two, the right. flag, young, beautiful American princess right. one, and our founding mother. So I think I think she's the one. Mm. So tell me again what your final decision is? Her, the one in the beautiful blue dress with the wonderful white wig. That's it? That's it. You're sure? I'm sure. No That's going back now, Frank. No undo. All right, ladies. Will the real woman please step forward? That attitude. No way. She scared me. <laughs> Go get your song. Get your song. So you know what this means now. Yeah. Someone has to go to the dog pound. It's not going to be you, though. No, it's certainly not, Brooke. All right, Frank, it's going to be Monica, Doug, or Jennifer. Who's going to the dog pound? Yeah, Doug, if you could just go ahead and go over to the ah! dog pound. That'd be great. Thanks. The reality is, is I'm the biggest threat anyway, so it's, it's probably best that I'm Actually, the dog pound. Actually, the reality is you're going to the dog pound. <laughs> you know what, Doug? Unfortunately, in this situation, Frank is right. Take a walk, buddy. See ya. Congratulations is in order, Frank, for knowing what a real woman looks like. Well, you know, thank you. <laughs> Our next challenge tonight is called liftoff. One of you is going to be hanging on for dear life in the tank and trying to grab those flags. And did I mention it's about to start raining in here? Somebody here might not be prepared for the downpour. It's time to choose the loser. We're going to rain on someone's parade when we return to Doggy Dog.